Hey everybody, it's Lynn from A Bit of Birdsong. I wanted to drop in and show you something that I have been working on. First of all, let me show you this version. This is newly listed in my Etsy shop. It's called Gothic Studio and it is four pictures from my workshop. You know, I have a lot of old things, gothic things, and I love old books. I love creepy dolls and statuary and skulls. So I think these turned out absolutely beautiful. I've been really interested lately in taking black and white photos and I think these turned out great. So this is in the shop. It's one sheet and you can download this, use it in your projects. Um, of course, I just ask that you not sell the digital files, but it's fine with me if you use these in your journals to sell or whatever. And again, these are just pictures from my art studio. And this is what you can do with these. I grunged these up quite a bit. And again, I wanna share a thought about printers. I have an inkjet printer and the ink will spread around and fade pretty easily with water if you're not careful. So be aware of that. I do use water on mine. I used water on an ink stamp to make these designs on the back. And then I used distress ink. Um, I don't have a laser printer and that ink is more permanent as soon as it you know hits the page and dries. I love the way these turned out. So that's got a tag sewn onto the front that says 13 and you can see the distressing on the back of that. I love this. There's a rusty safety pin sewn into place and I love the black butterflies. I think that feels really gothic. So there's this one. And then this is a piece of statuary, or it's it's very, very heavy. I have dried roses in the top of it. It's really pretty. I, I need to do sort of a soft color image of this one because it does have dried pink roses in it. In the meantime, I love these black and whites. And then this is one of my bookshelves out in my workshop with all the old books. I have books on that shelf going back to the 1700s, which is really amazing. I'll have to show you one of those books sometime. Uh, it's just incredible to think that things could be around that long. And those are distressed. Again, the black butterfly. These would be awesome in a Halloween journal. I'm gonna sell this set that I've worked on. These are gonna be listed in my birdsong shop and I will have a link to that below. I'm going to wrap these in a piece of Martha Stewart glassine paper. It's kind of loud, so I'm not going to fold it while I'm talking. The color is called nasturtium, and it's the most beautiful color. It's kind of a pinky orange. And I'll wrap it up with this really pretty ribbon. That's so perfect for Halloween. These are ready to go out, and they will be in the shop. Thank you. Bye for now.